Well, I'm such a big fan of horses, so I thought, well, why not uh, try to make a video about horses? But I don't know what to do, so I thought, well, why not try to make a video of me drawing a horse? So let's see how I can do this. I'm going to take a, you know, uh, inkjet, you know, photocopy paper, and uh, this is a fine art graphite uh, credit color uh, F. Uh, sometimes I can use. HB, but anyway, let's see what I can come up with. Uh, I don't have that much time, so I'm going to try to do this quickly. Uh, it normally would take like maybe an hour to do something good, but I'll try to see what I can do in about 30 min uh, or 10 minutes or something. Start with something that looks like a circle. Uh, not really much of a circle, but whatever. Let's try to draw the, the nose. The eye here. You know what I like about horses uh, is that uh, you know compared to uh, beef, uh, horse meat is a uh, a lot more uh, lean. It's got a bit less calories per gram, but uh, less um, less protein too. But it's it's very similar. But here's the thing. Uh, if you buy a uh, horse meat, the the price is about the same as uh, as if you were buying beef. Okay, it's it it doesn't really cost more. Uh, but um, the thing is that you get more bang for your buck with uh, horse meat, and the reason for that is actually very simple. Um, what happens with horse meat is that, well, with uh, beef is that when you cook beef. Uh, the volume of, of uh, the meat goes down by I think maybe even as much as 30 or 40 percent you know for example if you take uh, 250 grams of uh, beef and you cook it uh, when you're actually going to eat it you're not going to get 250 grams it's going to be something like uh, I don't know maybe uh, 200 grams or you know something like that it's not gonna be uh, anywhere near uh, uh, as much you know so anyway I'm trying to hurry up here because you know I really don't have that much time I'm not a YouTube partner anymore so I can't have a uh, unlimited time uh, for my video so I'm gonna have to, to go as fast as possible uh, so obviously it's not gonna come up to be very good but let's see what I can come up with try to figure out more or less where the eyes are going to fall and I think maybe the jaw is a bit small here let's see uh, you have the, the mouth here, I don't know if it looks like a mouth you know when you try and draw something uh, like if you want to draw a horse the way to tell if you're drawing a successful is if it looks like a horse you know if you try to draw a horse and it looks like a rabbit you know, then that's not good. But if it looks like a horse, then well, that's okay. And uh, now I don't have enough space in, in the paper, so uh, the, the nose is a bit too short. But well, it doesn't really matter anyway. Uh, we'll do with that. Um, so the eyes should be more like this. Have the hair come come out something like that. Uh, there's another word for hair, I think. Uh, hair sounds too human. I mean, we're not talking about human, we're talking about a horse here. Um, and, uh, you know, if it's a girl, you can have a little, you know, thing here like that. You know, it look cute. Little ribbon, you know, pink ribbon. And if it's a guy, well, I don't know, you can uh, draw a really huge penis somewhere, but of course this uh, it's only the head so you can't really see it from here no I don't think horses normally have hair this long but this is a girl and it's kind of like fashionable for girls to have long hair uh, so I have this cute chick here like that How much time do I have left? I, don't, I think I pretty much... It's only four minutes, all right. I had to stand up to look at uh, the timer on, uh, on my camera because uh, I don't uh, 
No, I, I, I can look at my watch, but uh, I'm not sure what time I actually started making the video. I forgot to, to check it out, so All right, let's go quickly here. You know, it's funny about horses, uh, when, when I go to a, a stable, okay, I haven't been in one for, for a while, but w when I do go to a stable, uh, the one thing that really uh, bothers me to no end, okay, is the smell of horses. It's like, kind of like a sweat, or I don't know, there's like some kind of a smell that's very recognizable. When I smell this, I know there's a horse somewhere nearby, you know, and I, I just, for some reason, I, I can't stand it, you know, I really can't stand that that smell. There's just something absolutely disgusting about it, and I just can't quite put my finger on it. Uh, it's just something I, I, I can't stand. And, uh, you know, the, the, the thing that's really strange is that uh, when I buy horse meat, you know, and uh, uh, the, this wonderful butcher, uh, and the corner of uh, Oshilaga and Nicolas. Uh, uh, it's uh, in Montreal, right next to the Joliet uh, subway station. So I guess if anybody is looking for some good meat, they should uh, go there. Uh, in any case, um, when I buy the, the horse meat, what I notice it's kind of freaky, but there there are horse meat smells. You know, there's a distinctive smell, and it really reminds me of that strange smell that um, that you have uh, you know when uh, when you go to a stable it, it, there, there's something kind of similar you know it, it's kind of a similar smell and it's really really weird uh, you know it, it's uh, it's kind of freaky it really reminds you that you're eating a horse you know uh, and not some kind of strange, uh, weird animal that you've never seen. There's something about eating animals that you've actually seen, that you've actually interacted with. You know, if you've actually ridden a horse, as I have some years ago, it's a weird feeling to actually eat it. You know, it's like, wow, I remember these kind of animals. But if you're eating beef, I mean, I've never met a beef. Uh, I don't know what beefs are like. I mean, I, I don't know about this stuff. So, uh, you know, when I'm eating beef, it, I mean, it's like... If I'm eating chocolate chips or something, you know, it's like I don't feel like I'm eating something uh, alive, you know. I, I mean, uh, I eat turkey, no problem. I've never met a turkey, so that's the thing about horse is that it's kind of a strange feeling, especially if you like horses, whatever. All right, uh, this turned out pretty ugly because I don't have that much time, so I'm going to strip it off. All right, so... Uh, See you guys some other time. I'm going to try to make a video of some kind of a kitchen recipe, but you guys got to post some ideas, because frankly, I just have absolutely no idea, no earthly idea what kind of recipe to make. So, um, well, anyway, see you guys uh, some other time.